Welcome back, we're the Bourbon Junkies. He's Dan, I'm Sean. Tonight. ECBP C923. 13 year old Elijah Craig barrel proof. Supposed to be good, we'll see. Our huge shout out to our buddy, Zach, over at Bourbon Kingdom YouTube channel. Check them out, they're literally great people. Um, Dave has some crazy allergies come to find out. Hates bees. Not a oh, big really? bee guy. I don't know. He looked like he got stung by a bunch of porters in the park. Love you. Um, now, just just pop the cork. It's almost like wax at this point. Oh, it, well, there's a it's too much, yeah. Thing around her. <laughs> there we go. Hey! All right, we opened her. Opa! Is that what they say at Jewish weddings? And they go and step on the glass. Why do I feel like that's Greek? Greek? Opa is Greek. Is it Greek? Yeah. Okay. 13 year, seven month, 133.0 proof. Over 13 and a half. Yep. What was the proof you just said? 133.0, that's a hot gal. Well, welcome to hell. I don't know the last time I've seen a 130s ECBP. They feel like they've all Minute. been in the 120s. They feel like, as of late, with all due respect, they've Substandard. been not good. Yeah. So, hoping hopes are high on Ooh. this release. And if you like this blend, you know, you can go to bourbonjunk.com backslash shop. Very soon. And they should be there. If they aren't there in this Soon. field, they'll be there in the same week this, this video is released. Mondays, yeah. So, so they'll be up there shortly. With a bunch of merch. If it's not, I'll just cut that. Go whole support thing. virtue. Yeah. Through merch. We're close. I gotta go just support do some paint. Before I move on, we gotta say a special thank you to one of our hundred dollar patrons. Yeah. You know, this is a really cool bottle. It uh, is. so we figured we'd cheers to you guys. John Miller, shout out to you. Thank you, thank you for, for support, supporting buddy. us. Appreciate it. And uh, we'll get you a little sample hand delivered to you. Sure. You said cheers and then didn't cheers. I got a sip on both times, a little nip of it. Great whiskey. Back to it. This smells phenomenal. Great. Thank Jesus. Thank oh, Elijah Craig for finally coming around. You know what I mean? And I think he's dead. I'm assuming, well, he's supposed to be the father of bourbon or yeah, something. Dude, so I he's definitely it. dead. Yeah. But huge shout out to Elijah. This has some Ooh, of the, the, like, the sweet, like, I always say like grassy notes, and you know what I'm talking about. But remember that pirate bottle that we just opened? Yes. It had a ton of that. Yes. This has a little bit of that. This feels like some of the older stuff. And not that it's just 13 years old. It actually feels like older distillate. It feels like it was released several years ago. Yes. That's what he's trying to say to you right now. Like if this was released eight years ago, this is what I think it would smell like. If they would just, this, and I haven't, you know what? I'm getting my hopes really high. I've just smelled it. It smells great. It smells old. It smells like a stag. Uh, competitor. Feels like it belongs in the ballpark of the good stags, the good Elijah Craig Barrel Proofs. The nose on here is on par with those. Yeah, there is that like Syrup. sweet, like syrupy Fat. peanut butter, yeah. fatty notes in there. It does it's have a whiskey. good amount Holy of wood in there too. Fat whiskey, 100%. 13 years at barrel strength, we'll do that. We've had some like 12s that were not good. This smell, this, the nose on this is fantastic. Before we get back to our video, we got to talk about today's sponsor, our very favorite shirt slash clothing company that we've been working with literally, I think, for three years, Into the AM. Into the AM.com slash bourbon junkies will get you a discount on some sweet fall looking, Halloween looking merch. This shirt is my new favorite one. I used to have one, had a skull on it from Into the AM with some roses on the back. That was my favorite. This one has since replaced it. If you live in a place where it gets cold, they have hoodies, they've got joggers, they've got sweat shorts. If you live somewhere where it's warm all the time that are super comfy, into the am.com slash bourbon junkies, just rip on over there, get a discount right off the bat. Bundle up a few t-shirts, honestly. Great deals and fantastic t-shirts. Fit great, last a very long time. And they constantly have like rotating deals over there as well, in case you're just looking for something as a gift for somebody else coming up for Christmas. So. Go check out the new graphics. I got three of them in the house. Cookie would appreciate you supporting people that have supported the channel for a very long time. For real, we love them. Best clothes on the market without a doubt. And honestly, best value. So back to the video. Cheers. This is gonna, we finally, I'm basing a lot on the nose right now. Just let that be known. That'll be we fun. We finally, Got an Elijah Craig barrel proof that's going to be in the end of the year blinds yes. with high expectations. And I actually think it'll be up there. 
Oh man, that's good. That is fantastic. It just it leaked is, everywhere. It's so oily. That does not drink 133. That is one that drinks of like a 123. Oh, it's still warm. Man. You get that hug, but it just kind of coats. It's oily. so fatty. Yeah. And savory, and heavy, heavy. Like my tongue is heavier after drinking it. Mm. Sugars, oils. Fantastic. You know what this reminds me of, actually? Oh my gosh. Jack Daniels Single Barrel Barrel Proof. I think those are usually still better. But, um, but it's got that like really savory um, mouthfeel to it. It's a little on that side of nutty. There's yeah. no banana or anything in there. Um, it's all like a honey sweetness, maybe a syrup. Oh, man. It's phenomenal. That is that That's is good. what I want ECB it's finally here, huh? to be. Goodness gracious, we we did in the past lean into the C batches more often Always. than we leaned into the A's and B's. Yep. There was a couple B's in there that were okay. There was an A or two we did prefer. A couple but A's and B's that we liked. The C's were had used to be great. I think that is better. We drank C919 last night. Yeah, I think that's better than C919. Yeah, it's pretty close. We drank it last, like it was very recent, not like yeah. a week ago. That. Honestly, this is the first one that's competed with, I think, with C919 at all in a very long time. Dude, it smells like perfect Elijah Craig. Yeah. Like perfect Heaven Hill. This almost could have went into a Parker's release. Oh, uh, man. I don't know about that. I mean, it's good. I don't think it's Parker's level good. I do. It's better than a... the wheat one. Oh. Yep, it is. I said it. It's better than that. I don't even regret it. I mean that with my Your... heart. It's right there. Guarantee it. I guarantee the amount of caramel, like those reason candies that is in this whiskey is freaking awesome. I don't awesome. think there's that much chocolate. What? What are you? Palette? Handicapped? I don't have a, I was, I had a word in my head. I still can't find it, but I know what word I wanted. It wasn't that one. Hmm. The Parker's weed is mid. Doesn't smell better. I'll tell you that. Elijah Craig smells better than the Parker's wheat. Nah. C923, the maybe one of the whiskeys of the year is where we're at. That feels like it's gonna be a top 10. It'll be a top five. Uh, I do want the best of money. Name four. Know. Name the other four. Well, I'd have to sit Jack 12. Like, well, that's definitely 100%. Be in there. 13th County Double Oak. Uh, Maker's um, Cellar. Okay. Um, I don't know. I honestly have to. Think around. That's where Voyage we're at. is pretty high for you. I know that. But high for me. I yeah. I agree. I don't think it's like as good, but it is very. There's good. a couple things that we reviewed already this year and said will be high. Yeah. This for sure. Can we just named them all. Yeah. Yeah. For sure. Um, the twice barreled rye from Jack Daniels. Cold. That's a motherfucker. Yeah. That almost be put up it there last too. last night. Nope. Oh my gosh, no. Holy shit. Is Cellar Age better than that? Oh, Cellar Age. And it's is not a monster, close, huh? Yeah. Like, that's got. I will agree, I think this is the weakest of the Parkers in recent years. Tastes like past. markers. The Heavy Char Rye and Heavy Char Bourbon were far and superior to the Heavy Char Wheat. The Heavy Char Bourbon was like one of the best ones we've had. They should have renamed the Heavy Char Wheat the Crayola Parkers Heritage. Why? Because it tastes like fucking markers. That has the East, that has oh, the ECB so? note we don't like. 100% on the tongue. This is phenomenal whiskey. We paid a hundred dollars for this. It's an A at a hundred. A. Yeah. Plus. I, there's, probably. You're getting a 13 year product. It's high proof. Um, it is fantastic. It I think it's just a great. flat A, even at a hundred. You don't think that's better than that? I'm gonna. It is. Shit, it that be. could be a Parker's. Dang. Yeah. That's wild. This is the first CCPP in a Ooh. very long time that we were like, we really liked a lot. Actually, how sweet this is compared to the wheat yes. is wild. The yeah. wheat is like funkier. Brown butter, raisin, caramel, char, oak, friggin' maybe a little black pepper on the late finish. Great whiskey. There's overall. a nice, um, love that. Like, love it. Holy shit. Charred vanilla it. on there too. I'm just not a Heaven Hill guy. Like I, we've learned this over time. Sean's closer to a Heaven Hill person than yeah. I am. That, it, dude, I still think like a Stag 22A is better for yeah. me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But personally, I truly believe that that is a competitor this year. 
Yeah. That is sweet as If hell. you're a Heaven Hill person, that is one of the best whiskeys that's come out in a long time. Truly. I don't feel like that's full Heaven Hill profile. Like, I feel like it's a throwback to what they used to be. I, yeah, like, I'm not Their stuff you. used to be a lot sweeter, I feel. And then it's kind of become more of like a, a savory aspect. It's become more markery. We've Maybe. got it in like three releases in a row, which is Maybe. so sad. You know what's such a godsend? It's such an Elijah Craig send. This. That it is not a marker note. Yep. Love it. Huge fan. Thank you, Zach, for helping us obtain this one, buddy. We appreciate it. You know, there's that heat. Elijah Craig it. is a beautiful founder, the father of bourbon himself, back huge comeback, underdog, rocky levels of underdogness here. Had low expectations. Damn. Hit it out of the park. I, I hadn't heard good things, but I didn't think it was going to be I didn't hear. top 10. Bro, that's good. Yeah. It's good, good. Yeah. Yep. We good, good. Damn. Man, that's fantastic.